Some time ago, one of our customers got a fully electric Audi e-tron into his shop. The customer complained is that the car sometimes was making strange noises. So the technician took the car for a test drive and indeed, after some time when the car had warmed up, he started experiencing a noise originating from somewhere around the front axle and it sounded exactly like a failing wheel bearing. He drove the car back to the shop, put it on a lift, only to find out that he couldn't hear or feel anything wrong with those wheel bearings. He took the car for another test drive, but this time he didn't experience the sound. So he was pretty sure it wasn't a failing wheel bearing, because that usually isn't intermittent. He didn't know what to do, so after he drove for a while, he decided to head back for the shop. On the way back, he turned on the AC, and there it was again, the sound of that failing wheel bearing. This shop is subscribed to DDTSB, so when the technician got back to the shop, he took some time to search our database and pretty soon he had a hit. And that's because we have seen this before. This is actually a pretty common issue on Audi e-trons. On the Audi e-tron, the radiators, both the coolant radiators to cool the high voltage components and the air condenser for the heat pump system, those radiators are located in the left and right wheel arch. And they are cooled with an electric fan. Now, because these radiators are air-cooled, the inner wheel arches can't be fully closed, so they have an open design to allow airflow. A very poor design, if you ask me, but it is something we have to deal with. These cars drive through rain, snow, mud, salty roads, sand, gravel, you name it. And all that dirt, rocks, gravel, and even sticks they collect behind that plastic wheel arch, in the place where those electric fans are sitting. The things that can happen because of this issue and the sounds you can experience can differ. Because when water and salt and sand makes it into the bearings, the bearings of the cooling fans can fail and that can sound like a failing wheel bearing, just like the customer in this story. But we've also seen that sometimes a stick gets stuck in there and it barely touches the cooling fans and then you hear a knocking sound. We've even seen that fans fully lock up either because the bearings are seized or because of dirt collecting between the fan blades. The cooling fans turn on when the high voltage component needs to be cooled, when you turn on your heat pump or for example when the battery needs to be cooled when you're charging your vehicle. And that means the sound is intermittent, so it's very important to talk to your customer because they can provide you with some pretty important clues. Sometimes you can resolve the issue just by cleaning the fans. But when the bearings get noisy, you have to replace them. But note that Audi knows about this issue and they've actually assembled a repair kit with updated parts that according to Audi should reduce the issue. When you have a customer driving an e-tron, we also advise you to clean behind the inner wheel arch whenever you're performing a service. Luckily, this workshop was subscribed to DDTSB and within minutes they knew exactly what was going on and they had all the information on how to fix this issue professionally. If you're also interested in known faults and solutions like on this Audi or thousands of others, then go to diagnosedan.com and when you click on buy now, you can see our prices and subscriptions.